I'm a little bit depressed this evening guys because as I went home this afternoon I saw this one okay this is my sudo clamorous gigas this is my third orange chevron tarantula guys and this is what happened she's soft already she's not moving so huh, she's dead already okay guys yesterday I checked on her and she's just fine only that she's not moving a lot already so I didn't know I didn't expect that there's something wrong will happen today I didn't know or I don't know the reason why she's dead okay only that I'm suspecting that the temperature went up this afternoon and this is what happened she's dead already guys she died and I just want to say goodbye <laughs> Hello everyone, this is me again, Super Junkie. What's up to all the super individuals out there? So this is my Tiltocat Vegans, guys. This is my female one. Okay, this is the one we made it last time. And this is our mature male. Look at that. He's so fine and ready to go, ready to fight. So what we are vlogging today is that we have another two mature females guys coming from my friend okay and this is uh, here they are okay look at them so they are sealed and there's a name in here this is coming from my friend Simeon so this is her mature female Tiltocat Vegans or the Mexican Red Rump okay look at that look at that big bot and this one is coming from my friend Chrisman yeah look at the bot okay so there's a name on the container so that I may not be confused later when I breed them so um, expecting that the male will be able to do it but first, before we are going to make them guys, we need to rehouse them first and make them comfortable. So I bought this plastic container. These are mega box and 9 liters, which costs 100 pesos only. Oh, so it's cheap. So I made holes already. Look at that. At the top and at the side of these containers. And we'll be placing here our teas and here they are so here's our coco peat and let's go put them in three hours later can you move it along i'm all out after several hours guys here is our enclosure so i let the coco peat or substrate settle first and we are now placing a plastic cups there you are to serve as water dishes for our teas so I made the enclosure plain just plain no other decorations but the water dishes is important of course so to make our teas more comfortable when mating so this is the female mature female of our friend Chrisman and I'm placing it to the left okay because I won't be uh, placing any labels so I like, put Christmas female on the left because in our ABC uh, A B C D F G H I J K L K L Christmas is to the left okay and so I think that makes sense do I make any sense? 
so look at that I'm placing now the mature female on her new enclosure look at that she's playing on the tissue paper and I think she doesn't want and she is holding on the tissue paper look at that so let's be careful guys I don't want to put any stress on this female okay yep good girl you're such a good girl okay so let's remove the residues of the tissue paper mm -hmm. so next is our friends mature female okay this is coming from my friend Simeon look at her female this one is darker yeah so if I'm not able to place any label, I would know because of their coloration. So I'm putting Simeon's female on the right because my basis is also our ABCD. So QRS. So right is Simeon. Right is Simeon. Okay. Chrisman is on the left. Okay. So that's it. This uh, female of Simeon is bigger than Chrisman, guys. And look at the coloration also. The difference between the coloration. You may be able to say which is Chrisman's and which is Simeon's. So, that's a great comparison between the two. And of course, my female has a scar on the abdomen look at that so let's settle them first before we uh, i think a one day is okay one day rest is okay so let's close this one let's settle them first let's uh, give them rest okay because they've traveled so far also before we are going to mate them okay what do you think guys i think rest is very important for our teas when traveling so let them settle first so guys thank you very much for watching this video of course before i forgot i would want to thank the bite exotic and chan tv for always commenting and for all the support god bless